find ourselves today in Romans 12, 17. Please stand for the reading of God's Word. Ego preto vestri anima sole hum deus. Dominis patri, i fili, i spiritu santi. Do not repay anyone evil for evil. Be careful to do what is right in the eyes of If it is possible, as far as it depends on you, live at peace with all. Freeze! Do not take revenge, my dear friend, but leave room for God. On the contrary, if your enemy is hungry, feed him. If he is thirsty, give him drink. In doing this, you will heap burning coals onto his head. as your Lord and Savior, my son. Go with God. This is the word of God. You may be seen. This one is my favorite. Cinnamons. So I see you get past my 10 guards. There were 57, not including the one behind me. Ego precor vestri anima un deus, dominis patri, i fili, i spiritu santi. So you have been this one tracking me. A priest. The wicked flee when none pursue it. Well, this is end of line for you, priest. You have any last words before I blow your head off? There is one little verse that I like. The wages of the righteous is life, but the earnings of the wicked are sin and death. 
So now I get on my knees and repent. That would make me joyful, yes. But you see, I believe that although every soul can be saved, there's a certain type of man, such as yourself, who is so far in wickedness that there is no hope for repentance. And from that, he cannot be saved. Saved? From what? God's wrath? <gasps> so scared. No. My gun. <laughs> You scare me when you do that. So? Cheerleading tryouts. I thought I'd give it a shot this year. You weren't gonna run this by me first? I was, but you had one of your church meeting thingies. Well, meeting or not, girls throwing each other up in the air doesn't seem like the safest hobby in the world. You know, someone makes a careless mistake and you end up with a broken neck. When are you gonna let me do something fun, huh? I mean, something than just standing around cooking eggs all day. Why don't you go out for Glee Club? I've heard you sing every Sunday since you were this big. You have a beautiful voice. I just feel like it's a safer alternative. We use pom-poms. What could be more childish and innocent than a pom-pom? I'm not gonna have my daughter be put in harm's way. It's not fair, Dad. You know what we'll do tonight when I get home? We'll pray on it, okay? That obviously means no. Well, it's not my fault that Jesus and I agree on those things. I'll see you tonight. You said we'd have lunch today. Next week, huh? That's number six. Next week, I promise. The church just really needs me right now. I'll see you later. Go fish. It's back! Ha <laughs> ha! Let's throw a party! Salute. Very good, son. Okay, back to business. Time to finish plan to blow up White House. Um, sir? All of your plans have been infiltrated. We're back to square one. Oh. Let's blow up Taj Mahal! Uh, boss, before we do anything too drastic, uh, me and some of the guys have been talking about taking some time off. Time off? I just get back! You cannot leave! Well, the Italians, they're, you know, help wanted for henchmen, so... The Mafia is so last century! Listen, as a henchman, we have a big rep to live up to. And, uh, you're the boss who, uh, <laughs> just got beat up by a priest. <laughs> and, uh, that can be a bit embarrassing. I just escaped from prisons using only toothpicks. Does this not scare you? Your house is painted pink. This color is swirl of rose. I, I think it's a more pepto bismol -y. So you're saying I'm not scared, huh? Yeah? Stand up. How's this for scary? Yeah, that really doesn't do it for me. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just shoot? The priest. This is a good idea. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. I have a good idea too. Yeah. Pepto Bismol this. Oh. 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 You have little Tommy's egg. Lick the wall. Maybe you'll feel better. Dad, was that really necessary? What? I haven't killed in a while. What? So shooting them both makes you feel better. Uh. Oh. Oh. Little bit, yes. Graf, put Taj Mahal plans on hold. Hunk, take these two guards and go kill Xavier. I'm reading. Oh, you're reading? Okay. In this case, take Horace with you. No, 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 I'm sorry, it was a joke. Go. Horace! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I call shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> Kill 
Greetings. My name is General Jeremiah Turgeson, and I am here today to brief you on a terrorist named Vladimir Krovnuts. For the past 20 years, Krovnuts have been responsible for the deaths of thousands of innocent people by orchestrating some of the world's biggest disasters. Boom! Kablam! Up to this point, the Pentagon has been powerless, so they have come to us, the Assassinators, to take this dirty son of a out once and for all. Well, there you have it. The job is ours. We are the Assassinators. Dismiss. Damn fine film. It gets better every time I see it. Well, I hate to break up this love fest, but I'm afraid I have some bad news. Grove Nuts has escaped. <laughs> According to our best intel, those 50 guys you took out last week were only half of his force. Now, oh, man, screw that. You seen this TV? The other half infiltrated this base and busted that wacko out. Stop. So I'm reassigning you to Project Grove Nuts. Let's see. Crab, crab, have it. Ooh, what's in the future? Crab. <gasps> Earrings for Mama. <laughs> you bring him back here. The priest is not here. All right. Hey, let's move. So we can put him in a cold, dark cell and interrogate the hell out of him. Boris, take your phone. Already got it. <laughs> Xavier, be careful. Heaven only knows what goes through that psychopath's mind. Give me the president. Hello, Ms. Nightingale's pleasure to meet you. My name is Vladimir Krovnot, savior of universe. This is my son, Hug. We bring you to our beautiful home today so you can be your father's bait, yes? <laughs> you know your room's pink, right? It's so clearly not pink. It's called Swirl of Rose. I swear. Right. Would you get started? Yes, excuse me. It's time for interrogations. Now it's first time for Hug, so if you cooperate as father, I really appreciate, okay? Take it away, Hunk! I'm gonna hurt your feelings. No, Hunk, real physical pain! You know, here, uh, here. Use knife. I'm gonna cut your hair. I... Horace! Bed, sit, I sit! Bed, Horace, sit! Huh, focus, okay? Don't cut hairs, cut neck, okay? I'm gonna cut your neck hair! Holy, seriously? What? Nicole! Nicole! Nicole, are you okay? I was upset here you were not at home when my men came to visit. That was unfortunate, yes? Tell me what you've done with my daughter. Who cares? You ruined my master plan. Now, I kill you. <laughs> if you lay one hand on her... What? <laughs> you uh, splash me with holy waters? Use your Jesus power to save my sins. <laughs> Vladimir, please. I just want my daughter back. You want her? You'll meet my men at your church in one hour. Now we play my game. You've just made the biggest mistake of your life, Kravnots. Oh, I'm really scared. Xavier is going to pray for me. <laughs> Don't worry about that, Vladimir. When it comes to scum like you, 
I shoot first, pray later. Okay, good one, snippy. Hello? As I kneel before you here on the battlefield, I pray you hear my cry. If I must kill, I do so to rid the world of evil so that your kingdom can flourish on this earth. On a side note, dear Lord, thank you for my two favorite Uzis, Mary and Martha, along with Judas, my Italian crafter 12 gauge shotgun. Ooh la la, ba ba sis boom ba. Xavier's going to die today, do da, do da. May your justice be done on this earth, as it is in heaven. Xavier, you shall die. <laughs> I want backs up now! Send more men to kill that son of priest! Where's my daughter? Are you making words up? 
because I have no idea what that is. No, uh, you don't have to come any closer. You know what? I have to go because there's that thing I signed up for on the website by look. Get off the bike! What the heck, man? Get over there! Over there! Over there! Ah! Young lady, I'd like to purchase this bicycle. Take out the money. Whoa! That's a hundred dollars. Keep it. Thank you, my child. Thanks! to know the location of Vladimir Kravnats. Never! <laughs> okay, okay, okay! He's at 562 Northwestern Way, up in Hartford. If you're gonna go now, I'd leave yourself at least 30 to 45 minutes with traffic on the freeway. But I mean, if you're gonna take surface, it might be better, but there's a lot of construction, so I mean, it's really six of one half dozen the other. I... Do you read the Bible? Maybe? Okay, no, no. Take this. Might do you some good. But I can't read. Do you have an audio version? It's got pictures. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, it does. Look at that man on the tiny T. So, what are you reading? Hello? Jules Verne. Which book? Why are you interested? Well, there's nothing else to do. From the Earth to the Moon, if you must know. So, you like science? No. But I like his writing. I want to be an architect. <laughs> I don't see what's so funny about that. Well, you know, it's just kind of different from your current position. Well, my dad's not too fond of it. The only thing he wants me building is his empire. So torture isn't your game, huh? I do to please him. Like good son should. <laughs> As, as he says. It's okay. My dad won't let me be a cheerleader. That's understandable. You know, those pom-poms are pretty unpredictable. The frills could go anywhere. Cut your eye out. <laughs> He's just being overprotective. My mom passed away a few years ago. If he was protective then, 
It's just even worse now. I'm so sorry. Hey, hey, Hank. I wanted to cool it with this hangsy pangsy. What did I tell you? Do not fraternize with enemy prisoner when I'm out of room. We were just talking. Hank, what did I just say? Yes, sir. Hello? You sent 50 men to kill me. You should have sent more. Your dad. Do they know each other or something? Is he some rival priest? And you know nothing about your father, do you? You do? Nicole, you're... Your dad's an assassin. <laughs> Funny. No, really. Okay. Wait, seriously? Ah! I want all my men, now! You don't have any more. You sent the last of them to kill Xavier. Oh, I shouldn't have shot those two guys. Mm. Hulk, take girl into other room. Nicole! Dad, it's okay. I'll be fine. I'm here to read you your last rites, my son. My last rites? Maybe your last throws. Nice color scheme in here. Is this swirl of rose? Yes! Hey! Ah! Ha ha! You deserve this for the rose business! I'm cool, man! Don't worry about your daughter. I will take very good care of her. Dad. Hunk, give me the key. I'm sorry, Nicole. I, I... Hunk, I need to help my dad. I, I, I'm not allowed to. I... Hunk, give me the key. No, I, I can't. I'm... No more jokes. Say your own prayers, priest. Oh! <coughs> That was quite a kick. <laughs> <laughs> well, the contact hurt a little bit. It was a kick that the cheerleading team would be very fortunate to have. Wait, really? Yeah. Nicole, listen. I have something really important that I have to confess to you. You're a part-time assassin? Wow. It was obvious? No. Hunk told me. Hunk? Dad, this is Hunk. Hunk, this is my dad. Hi! Uh, no. I'm good. Dad, is I, I mean, I'm, I'm good. I, I'm not a... You can trust me. Well, if you say so. And I'm sure your actions will prove that. Of course, sir. And just so you know, if you try to touch Nicole, the Lord will know. And smite you. <laughs> I wouldn't dream of it. Sir? 
Hank. Hank. Build empire. What? Build my empire, son. Oh. Have you ever taken any time to think about me, Dad? Has it ever occurred to you that maybe I don't want to be a supervillain? But my empire. Yeah, your empire is gone, Dad. No! No! Swear to the Rose! Swear to the Rose! Oh. Are you okay, son? Yeah, I'm fine. So what happens now? Well, first he goes to jail, and then I owe somebody lunch. Hmm, I'm kind of impressed. You need a hand with your dad? Okay. Hunk, oh. can I ask you a personal question? Sure. Have you accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? Oh, Dad! It's a perfectly innocent question. It's okay. I, I was very devious. Poor. Oh, swallows! Oh. General Turkeson. Ah, Xavier. Something's come up. Hey, Dad, don't forget about Tuesday. I won't, honey. We have an urgent mission that needs immediate attention. Goes by the name of the Snake Charmer. This lug nut is crazy as hell, and as of yesterday, he's number one on our hit parade. Intel says he's hiding out in the Swiss Alps. So your mission, should you decide to accept it. <laughs> I've always wanted to say that. <laughs> yeah, but you don't have a choice. So, your mission is to find him, bring him back here so we can interrogate the hell out of him. Your plane for Switzerland leaves tomorrow. Actually, sir, I can't tomorrow. Nicole has a cheer meet that I can't miss. Cheer meet? But I could leave right now. I could have it done by 10.30, midnight tops. Nail this bastard in one night? That's right. <laughs> I like the way you're thinking, son. That's why you hire me, sir. Well, go on. Get out of here. Well, I've got work to do. Actually, sir, this is my church. Oh, <laughs> right. Uh, I'll leave that. Oh, and Xavier, give him hell, soldier. I'll give him hell, sir. But mostly, I'll give him Jesus. Yeah.